working method is being constructed on Earth. Level 81 consists of many different office-like buildings similar to those on Earth. The interiors of these buildings vary, but many common themes have been noted. The walls of level 81 can vary in material from brick to concrete to wallpaper and can appear in several colors such as light blue, dark green, and yellow. These walls may also vary in texture and design. Equally, the floors of level 81 may appear as carpet, concrete, or occasionally laminate wood slats. Lighting within level 81 varies broadly. Light fixtures may flicker and cause blackouts similar to those in level 0 and level 1. Despite these imperfections, level 81 possesses a reliable power grid, and by extension, Wi-Fi. Windows are common and safe. No sightings of Entity 2 have been recorded as of yet. When first entering level 81, the level will be unnaturally quiet. After wandering for a few hours, various animal noises will be heard, and it's possible to encounter animals by following such noises. Many animals from Earth can be encountered, such as horses, pigs, canines, felines, cattle, birds, etc. Potentially dangerous creatures such as bears, lions are also present. The leading theory concerning level 81's large animal population, as proposed by MEG Regiment Compass Point, is that level 81 is the starting level for non-human creatures on Earth, in comparison to how level Zero is the starting level for humans. Despite the abundance of Earth animals within level 81, various entities can also be encountered, such as Smilers, Skin Stealers, Male Death Moths, Dullers, Jerry, and Howls, although it is possible more entities may inhabit the level. The overall structure and position of interiors in level 81 is considered unnatural. Various rooms have been observed clipping into other walls and generating attached vertical hallways that bend gravity accordingly. Some rooms may be filled with almond water, harboring several forms of sea life. The windows of level 81 project an outside area that can be entered, though this area shouldn't exist due to the mass of halls and rooms which should be obstructing it. When outside of level 81's office buildings, it's possible to view a long, winding road. It is also possible to observe several of the animals present within the building through windows. The outside area of level 81 appears to emit a subtle green light, which when in interacted with, directly or indirectly, causes all nearby animals to appear startled and retreat out of fear. The sky of level 81 is dark and cloudy, and no stars or other celestial bodies such as the moon are visible. Drone surveillance footage has captured many more buildings in the distance, however, attempting to reach these buildings will result in the offending individual arriving back at the main road. Level 82 is reminiscent of a very large mansion with different rooms. Although many times they will correspond to its door, other times the door can take you to other levels. This property increases the further you go into the house. In the beginning, the place seems completely safe, but the further you advance, the number of entities that appear increases. Right at the entrance to the level, a plaque is read in which the apparent owner of the mansion mentions the existence of a treasure. Although its existence has not yet been proven, many wanderers have decided to accept the challenge. Welcome to my mansion, wanderer. I'm sure you've been through a lot to get here, so I think you're up to the challenge. Hidden here is my treasure, more valuable than anything you can imagine. But don't think I made it easy for you. To get there, you must overcome challenges that will test your body and soul, so I know that you will be worthy of claiming it. I wish you the best of luck. I will be worthy. The Philanthropist. Level 83 consists of a sunken nuclear submarine named the USS Ace of Spades no in the middle of what seems to be an endless ocean. Me. The Ace of Spades lies on the ocean I floor inside a rocky underwater valley, wall. which a bathometer evaluation has revealed is at a depth of approximately 600 me. meters. The submarine's controls are non-functional, but the appliances inside of the vessel, such as light fixtures and kitchen appliances, are in solid working condition. The nuclear reactor of the Ace of Spades is still operational, and despite the wear on the outside of the hull, the interior remains intact. There are several refrigerators inside the Ace of Space that contain bottled water and several food items, such as sandwiches, pasta, fruits, vegetables, eggs, and meat. When removed from the refrigerators, the items will eventually restock, meaning the Ace of Spades contains an infinite supply of food and water. The makeup of the Ace of Spades <coughs> is identical to a Los Angeles-class submarine, with one exception. The Ace of Spades has several windows on both sides of the vessel, which can be used for observation. There is no known real-world equivalent to the Ace of Spades, and thus the MEG believes